Hello, this is Megan Silva and I'm standing outside of the Stockton Resource Fair that has been organized by the Phoenix Project in collaboration with Time Done Stockton. So my name is Henry Romero, I'm the student programs assistant here at Delta College. I work for Ricky in the Phoenix Project and what we do is we help students who have been formerly incarcerated or ever been in custody. What that sort of means is we sort of assist these students in any way possible. Um, we sort of meet them where they're at and sort of fulfill any need that they sort of need. You can kind of think of us as like a, a bridge to where the students want to get, right? So right now, this is one of our big picture events. It's where we come together with the community and try to put um, what we do out there and let them know that we're here to assist students. So we're kind of, this is a job fair with many resources that um, connect um, students that are like in our demographic that may need assistance with um, probation, parole, and, and other things such as housing, um, health care, and things like that. So today's event is for um, our students and the community to get to know us and help our students get any help that they need. So this is a resource fair. Um, we've partnered with Time Done Stockton and El Concilio to do this resource fair for folks that are re-entering back into society um, after spending time incarcerated. So this is an opportunity for not only resources to connect, but also for students and community members to be able to connect to resources. There's the education ones, us being with Delta College. We also have Stan State here. Um, and then we have community resources as well. We have public health here. And we also have the district attorney's office here. Um, that's especially important considering there's new um, bill that came into effect starting January 1 uh, regarding the expungement process for, for felonies. Yeah. SB 731 is a new law that went into effect that basically would allow records to be sealed if they are expunged. Um, before this, even when records were expunged, employers would still be able to see them when they pull up a rap sheet. And there'll also be new felonies that will be able to be eligible for expungement as well. I had a student in our Phoenix Project describe it as re-entering back after being incarcerated is like being born, um, but now as an adult. For more information, visit deltacollege.edu, The Phoenix Project. This has been Megan Silva.